One, two, thing. Boop. Okay. Hi. Hello. If you're watching this and you haven't watched my animation yet, do that. Now. Do it. Because I, I, that's why I stream, I delayed stream a hot sec. Because I wanted to watch it before I actually started stream. Um, but hi, hello, how's it going? The animation's officially out. Um, so that's fun. Um, but yeah, so also today, as you've seen, we are not playing, um, Stardew. We're not playing Stardew. And that is because um Seo has life things going on. So can't really um play Stardew right now. But we're gonna be doing something totally different that will make it so that I also don't have issues with um moving. Like I don't get dizzy because I've been getting dizzy a lot recently like the last like week ish and I feel bad but um so yeah the plan for today we're playing planet zoo um I feel I feel bad for having it at a weird let's do can we do borderless apply Confirm, can that, is that, that's better, yeah, that works a lot better, cool. Oh, no, we don't have the weird, awkward bars at the top and the bottom, let's go. <laughs> um, but yeah, so, when I was younger, I used to play a lot of Zoo Tycoon issue, um, Oh, Zoo Tycoon, we don't have, like, the second disc for it, which had, like, the Loch Ness Monster and all that stuff in there, so this is boring. Stormy! It's been a while. How's it going? Um, thanks, thanks. I hope you liked how I made your character. Your, I, I tried my best, but yeah, that that took me six months to do. <laughs> You're in there twice, technically, if you think about it. <laughs> You're in oh. You're in a background in one scene. And in the very end. So you're you're technically in there twice. The only person that's in there once is Max. But that's it. Have to rewatch to see the first. Fair enough, fair enough. Yeah, but I did it. I did it. Oh, I did it. It's amazing. I it it's the first animation project I've done solely by myself for myself, and it's great. Um so Back to Planet Zoo. What what sh what should be our thing for Planet Zoo? What 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 do, what do, what do we want to do? Let's let's do a career. I don't know what the heck I'm doing, and I'm hoping this teaches me how to do that. I I used to play. We're gonna go easy because I'm dumb. Um, renovated, renamed after its purchase. Cold food house. Okay, who cares? Um. Oh. I used to play Zoo Tycoon, but the issue is, is that we don't have one of the discs for it anymore. What the heck? Um, so, like, and that disc had all the cool stuff. I don't really want to play it. Okay. Night, Stormy. Will do. Oh, I'll be just chilling. <laughs> Anyways, but yeah, so let's let's see if I can actually play this now, or if I'm too dumb. <laughs> okay, I got an achievement for trainer issue. Um, the heck? 
Oh, we're finally getting cutscene. Okay. Plinko's a language? I thought that was a game. I played with a horse. Turn it up a bit for you guys. This is the first zoo I ever opened, and a source of great pride for me. And pride. Fun. Thanks to a lion breeding program we ran in the 80s. <laughs> but we're in the middle of a big renovation, and that's where you come in. Sadly, our old contractor had to retire after developing a fur allergy. Uh, poor devil kept sneezing his dentures into the lion allergy. habitat. So... It's up to you I thought you already had one. Everything off. Like, you have to have one to have Don't one. Don't worry, though. You know? I'm not completely throwing you into the deep end. My head keeper, Nancy Jones, will be lending a helping hand. Thank oh, you. She's a hard worker, and she'll expect you to be, too. Crap. <laughs> I'm sure you'll get along like a house on fire, or even better, one that isn't on fire. Less shouting that way. <laughs> Okay, Bernie's fun. Hello Love there. Him. From that rosy, fresh face of yours, I'm guessing you're Bernie's new hire. Good. Now, I hope yep. you're ready to ditch your diploma because we're about to get really hands-on. Okay. But before we begin the real work, how about we familiarize you with the zoo by learning how to fly around it and visiting some of our beautiful animals? We'll start by popping over and having a look-see at the grizzly okay. bears in their habitat. So where is the grizzly bears in general? Are they just here? Is that why? Did you know that grizzly bears, also known as okay. Ursus arctos horribilis, can hibernate for up to seven months a year? <laughs> well, but then again, given the chance, I think a lot of people would do that too. <laughs> well, that's Select the thing one that of the bears the and we'll bring up its information panel. Okay. Done. And this is where you can find out all kinds of information about your animal. The most important thing being its overall welfare. You'll learn more about animal welfare today as we go through your objectives. You but for now, let's enjoy this magnificent animal. Why don't you select the camera at the bottom of its it's information magic. panel? Okay, look at the West African See, now, this is a fantastic way to get a close look at your animals. You can also you get this view of an lady. animal by simply clicking on it. Okay, when you're ready, let's pop over to the other side of the zoo and take a look at the lions. Okay. I've marked their location for you to find. Panthera Leo Leo, or the West African lion to you and me. Lions oh, are the most social of the big cats, and there can be as many as 40 lions in a pride, although prides of that size are pretty rare. As Bernie would say, those lions are awesome, <laughs> which is precisely why I handle the training instead these days. Anyway, how about we get started on those objectives? Come on, let's head over to an empty habitat and see what needs doing there. That's not an empty habitat, because that's got an elephant. Is this an empty habitat? African shelter. I don't think this is a habitat. I don't think it can be. Wait, could it? I don't know. Okay, so wait. That's where it is. I'm dumb. It's fine. Okay, we're here. As you can see, we've located a it. Space for animals, but it's missing a certain something. Well, two something. <sighs> this lady is like, hey, do you want exposition? So like you to a pair of them. Too bad you're getting to it anyways. Animals, we need to open okay. the animal market, which is in the animal trading section. Okay, so. There we are, a pair Coming of perfectly hug, splendid warthogs for our zoo. Just click on them and select adopt from the side menu. Thank Normally the see. animal exchange would be full of animals, but I've emptied out the market while you learn how it works. The last thing I need is you accidentally ordering a dozen elephants. 
Come on, I should be able to order as when many elephants as I want. Mode, it's automatically placed in the trade center where they're held until you're ready to move them into their habitat, which, as it happens, you are. So how about you move them into their new home? Think I did? When you ask for an animal to be moved into a habitat, your caretakers will go to the trade center, collect your animal, and deliver them to your selected mm. habitat. I've marked the trade center's location, so let's go and watch the caretakers in action. Well, but we've already, yeah, we've 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 already done this because I sort of know how the game somewhat works. Because I, I I've tried to play this myself, and that's how I know I don't know how to play this game. Congrats, we've done it. Okay. Locate Animal Trade Center. Okay, that's here. Well, as you can see, those caretakers don't hang about. Hmm. They'll move those animals to their destination as fast as possible. Of course, normally we'd have to place the animals Remember. into quarantine before moving them into a habitat. But I am assured by a person of good standing. Hello, Mufloom. Are in the How's it going? Rudest of health. We right. are failing at this, or more up so we can listening to empathy. this chick talk so for so long. Has an overall welfare statistic, basically how happy okay. they are. And that overall welfare statistic is itself comprised of four different areas. Nutrition, social health, habitat, and enrichment. Can we... Luckily, if you select an animal, you'll bring up their animal welfare Surprise information the way you panel that you saw earlier. Yeah, I, oh gosh, it's because it's... That way, you'll know exactly if I turn this way, it's funky. Let's Don't do worry, this. That's a lot to remember. You can always check the Zoopedia for Maybe more information. That? Let's Wait. start by making sure we're taking Let's... care of the warthog's nutrition welfare. To do this, we'll need to place a food station and How does that a sleeping look? station. Now... Each animal requires a different type of feeding station. Oh. And for the warthogs, it's a small feeding trough. So let's add one of those and a water bowl. Oh, okay, so we can get that stuff now. I totally was paying attention to what she was saying. Uh, so we need a food trough. Let's put that about there. And then a water trough. Animals also require stimulation That's to keep them funny. happy. Yep. Let's add a lovely mud bath for the warthogs to roll around in. <laughs> that bath will lovely their mud bath. Welfare, specifically their toy enrichment welfare. Oh, nice work. You've got a knack for this, I see. Fair. Now, our contractor had to leave in a hurry, so this I've... place is in a feral state. Uh, I've made my videos accidentally like all over the shop, but the first thing we need go to way over time. Um, it's over near the hippos. Because I tend to try and keep 20 minutes. What are we doing now? I should probably pay attention. Locate the highlighted area. Highlighted. How about low lighted area? She's gonna get me in my British accent today, isn't she? Okay, we're here. We're here. Oh, looks like a pigsty. Start building our ostrich habitat. Let's pause the game. Just click the pause button in the bottom right corner. Done. Okay. Ah, that's more like it. A quick break. Sometimes it's a good idea to pause the game whilst you're doing something which requires your concentration because it'll stop the zoo spinning okay. out of control while you're looking the other way. Let's okay. keep the game paused while we get this ostrich habitat built. Yes. Okay. Job number one here is to add a habitat gate before we complete okay, the Okay, so I'm assuming that's some barriers. Every habitat needs habitat a habitat gate. gate. After all, how I think else it's just kind of like, put out. it here-ish. Just make sure it's hooked up so to let's... the path so the keepers can reach it. There we go. Right. Let's complete cool. the perimeter barrier so we can adopt us some ostriches. I've marked out an area for you to use, so I'd like you to finish off the perimeter using the brick barrier. I, I think I failed. I think I failed. How did I manage this? Okay, okay, wait. Maybe we can do it? Ba -ba -ba! Work. Remember, before you can place animals in any habitat, it has to have a full loop of connected barrier. 
Okay. Now, you've probably noticed that guests can't actually see into this habitat at the moment. No. At least not without a step ladder. But seeing as they're banned, I'd like you to select a piece of barrier and swap out the brick for a glass barrier so the guests can see in. What if they just can't see in? What 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 do we do then? Also, I feel like I messed it up again. Can we... Okay, control Z does work. Okay, can we do that? And then that? So excited for the 28th. What's the 28th? What's the 28th? What's going on the 28th? I'm so worried. What? Wait, am I screwing? Wait, what? Mm. Am I doing this right? Inside the place. Ah, uh, I was not doing it right. <sighs> yep. <laughs> Change about hot for me. Okay. But, mm -hmm. Oh! Am I being dumb again? Can we... Can we... So what is that? So we can make it really tall. Let's... You know, let's do that. Short? No. Um... The opening? Is it official that it's opening? Cause... No, that's not how... Now do you guys understand why I didn't play this game yet? Okay. So can we do... Defaulted, flat top, and edited... Snaps, just... Oh, sea level relative glass. <gasps> Outside placement. Uh um. Oh. So do I need to do it like this? Hey! I figured it out. There go. Adding in more windows gives guests even more opportunities Grace said, to see okay. animals in a habitat. It's always best to don't trust sure Gray on that because I don't know. Yeah, from the path they I don't on, think it is because, and because this would be a pretty I've never heard Sayo say that it would the be open on the twenty-eighth. A donation box. You see, when guests enjoy the view of an animal, they'll make a donation. Just make sure you put them in easy-to-reach places, like near a viewing point. Donation boxes are one of the main sources of income for the zoo, so make sure you remember them. Doop, 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 doop. There we go. Before we adopt our ostriches, you should click the play button. Ah, uh, yeah. If the game is set, so are our caretakers, which will make it a bit tricky for them to deliver the ostriches. Adopt and place four ostriches. As well as pausing the game, you can speed the game up by clicking on the fast forward button. No. It can run everything at two times and five times faster. Oh, it can be used oh I want the ostriches. To accumulate or for animals okay. to be delivered to your We're doing this. We're doing this. Personally, I okay. use it when I'm waiting for a brew to finish. All right, you've finished the habitat, so it's high time we adopted okay. those ostriches, don't you think? Let's get four ostriches. Of them in okay, wait, that's not... Yeah, so, um, compare mates, send to zoo, there we go. Um, yeah, I was pretty sure, because Gray didn't really talk to any of us about when was a good time to do any of those events. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I won't be at either of those, because he never had water station and an appropriate and yeah item. so i don't have time to, to be to at those like enrichments and um, feeding stations near to the habitat perimeter so oh. guests can get a really good view of the animals um the events that he's planned because i mm, like oh, good to see the ostriches oh, see. somewhere they can yeah. really stretch their legs 
Is holding game night on February 28th. Oh, February 28th. That may be. That might I may, may be able to do. forbid they ever escape. The speed but camera finds tends a long to do with that, bankrupt. Where he'll just be like, "Oh, we're doing this now." It's like, um, hmm, well, sir, certainly seems impressed. Did you do there's more people joke? here than just Every you. Time we get an ostrich. So now we've made the ostriches' lives a bit better. Did Let's we though? do the same for the keepers. Because I'm here. To make it easier for the keepers to feed the ostriches and hippos, we should build a new keeper hut. Keeper huts are where the keepers prepare the food for animals, so they should be placed near to the habitats to make sure the keepers don't waste their time Perfect. walking when they should okay. be looking Wait. after the animals. Wait. You'll need Wait. to rotate the keeper hut to get it to connect up to the path. Down Z. <sighs> okay, okay. That's a weird keybind for that, but okay. This keeper hut only has space for one keeper, but the larger keeper hut can allow multiple keepers to prepare food at the same time. Oh, but bear in mind that keeper huts and other staff facilities shouldn't be bear. placed near to areas bear. where there are lots of guests. Guests don't like seeing facility buildings, and it can affect their happiness. Negatively. <laughs> In case that wasn't clear. Well, it feels positively that be weird. It affects them needed. positively. And that obviously includes your newly built keeper hut. So let's place a transformer next to it, shall we? So if we go... Now, the reason everything just... has gone blue is because you're using the power heat map. This map allows you to see what is and what isn't powered in your zoo. So once you've placed just... your transformer, you can click in the bottom left to turn the heat map off. What? Okay. Ah, uh, there we go. So let's... I kind of like right there. Because I think that's sort of funny of having it in like such a weird position. Can we? Can we? Can we place it? Is it specifically like you have to place it? Horizontal. Lovely work. Now the keepers can start using the hut to prepare food, and thanks to where you put it, they won't need to walk very far to deliver it to the ostriches and hippos. Let's get on to your next objective then. Bengal tigers. There we go. We want to adopt some, but I'm afraid there's nothing ready for them yet. Head on over to the plot of land I've marked out. It's not too far away. Where is it not too far away? Lady! Lady, I don't know what you're talking about. Wait, she marked it. Locate the highlighted area. Flip is the highlighted area. There it is. That is far away. Oh, wait, that's not that far away. It's fine. Your next job is to build a habitat from scratch. <laughs> And concrete and glass i expect so go ahead and build it just make sure that the habitat includes that big hole we've dug oh and don't forget to add a habitat gate to the barrier okay oh and make sure the guests will be able to see the tigers no they're not going to be able to see the tigers we're going to make sure they can't see the tigers come on can, can i like I mean, this is an issue now. <laughs> this isn't a thing that I thought be an issue, but <laughs> we're here. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, that's perfect. <laughs> Turn your ang off your angle staff. No, it's funnier this way. Is that actually on? I don't know. I don't know if that's on. <gasps> we can make it pink. Wait, can we make them all pink? Wait, wait, wait. Turn that off. Turn that off. I want to select all of this. Make it pink. That's a better pink. 
I need to memorize the pink that's for um my branding. I don't remember. Like I don't like I remember it, but I don't like if you asked me to remember, I would remember it. Now, Bernie takes safety very seriously at his zoos, so we okay. should probably make sure those tigers can't jump out of their habitat, don't you think? No, it'd be the funnier way we that it way. Is by changing the height of the habitat's barrier. Okay then, you should start by double clicking the habitat barrier. Perfect. You into barrier editing mode. Great. Now highlight the entire perimeter of the habitat. You can do that by clicking and dragging the barrier selection there tool. There we go. We're just gonna have a weirdly large place. Don't forget to <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Three of your viewing areas. We need every dollar we can get. <laughs> Especially as these tigers aren't exactly eating instant noodles for lunch. Okay, that's the habitat boundary complete, the habitat gate in place. Dang it, and I wish we could most straight up the tigers won't be able to jump out spam of it anymore. Donation I think boxes. It's time we adopted those tigers. No. Wait, why, why are so many people visiting? I don't know why so many people are visiting. Okay, adopt. Send a zoo. Oh, we can't. I feel like this is a bad idea. Whilst our trusty caretakers collect and deliver the tigers, <laughs> let's take a look at preparing the habitat for their arrival. We'll okay. start with the basics. Add a suitable feeding station for them. No. We need to get a feeding station for them, though. Food tray. Okay, let's put this that there. Time, instead of adding a water bowl, let's try something different. Some animals need try a pool something in their different. habitat so they can go for a swim, but they can also okay. use it to drink from. All you have to do is Does make sure the pull? banks of the pool have a gentle Heck? slope so they can easily get a nice, refreshing drink. There's already a pool excavated, but you still need to fill it with water. You should do that by going into terrain and selecting the water tool. Terrain. That's... <laughs> Let's do rough water. Ballad. Okay. Add water. Oh, is it like... No, you have to do calm water. No? I hate that. <coughs> Wait for the line to turn blue. Yes, that'll do nicely. Of course, just like the warthogs and ostriches, these tigers will also need some enrichment. Why don't you add some suitable toy and food enrichment items into their habitat? Okay. And that is habitat. So you got a pumpkin. And a rubbing pad. Let's put it like... How close okay, can we put... Really oh my gosh, imagine putting it right there. Now... How much was the game? I think it was like 20 bucks. So they can hide from I the can't remember because I I got on discount like although given that we're in England, a while ago. So I don't know. Go on, add a shelter to their habitat. You can either build one from They're in the inside part. Like. The inside part. Get them out before. here. <laughs> Please. Please. Oh, poor Dabs. I'm sure it can't have escaped oh your attention that the tigers look a bit miffed. That's because they aren't too keen on the type of terrain in their habitat. Select a tiger and bring up its information panel. I think this should be the rest of the stream. But I don't think I can get away with that. Um, Because I would watch this. Look at how beautiful- That is grass! That is grass. And like... Look at what it they go. Yoke skelly. Okay, what are we doing? I don't know what we're doing. What are <laughs> I need to pay that they took the time to animate. Oh yeah. Well increase terrain welfare to a hundred. Okay, something terrain. Painting. Auto paint. Now snow. Do y'all like snow? No. Soft soil. Heavy soil. Rock. I don't know how you do rock, but I guess... 
I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of... Long... Oh, wait, wait, if we zoom in... We're killing... We're killing plants from painting. We're killing plants, and I'm not happy about it. Can, wait, wait, do we get it back? We don't get it back. Oh, we're monsters. I guess we did it. Mm -mm. They say the good <clears throat> fences make good neighbors. Okay. I guess that's doubly true when one of the neighbors is a Bengal tiger. <laughs> Still, a Brentus. Look so happy I don't like that. that. Eye of the tiger. I don't like oh, but this. For heaven's sake, don't test that theory. I'm gonna test that theory. Right. Let's head over to the Indian peafowls. I've been told that we need to improve their social welfare. Pea fowls? Why are they in mazes? Yeah. Just find one of the pea fowls and select them to open their information panel. Then we can have a good gander at how they're doing. Or Why are they in a maze? I suppose gandering would just be for geese. That's a peacock! That's Expand just a peacock. social welfare and we can get a bit more detail. Social group. We need more animals. Uh, now, they've clearly got plenty of space and they're not stressed, but it looks like their social group isn't quite right. So let's find out more. Click on the social tab at the top of their information panel to see okay. what's wrong. Adult population is... Right. As cute. you can see, the peafowls need their population to be larger. To solve this little problem, you'll need to adopt three more female peafowls. Three Off more. Pop to the animal market then. Send to zoo. Boop. Doop. 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 And then... Doop. 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 We did Good it. work on those pea fowls. I expect they'll be delivered soon. Our pea is coming sadly, in. sadly, it sounds like our snow leopard is a bit... Oh, All peas fowl. Let's head over there and see what's wrong with her. Okay. What are we doing? Snow leopard habitat. Okay. Just like people, animals can suffer from stress if things aren't quite right. You know, like when you see someone putting the milk before the tea bag. <laughs> In the case of these snow okay. leopards, they're a bit stressed by their lack of privacy. You can lower their stress levels privacy. by swapping out the normal glass barrier by their cave for one-way glass. It's not a cheap option, but I think they're worth the expense, don't you? This will give the snow leopards somewhere to go when they want to get away from the prying eyes of the guests. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Can we? The fact that it's like, oh, um, they're very uncomfortable with their habitat and having to deal with all that. So instead, um, we're going to add course, in, an animal isn't in its natural biome, it's probably going to be one way glass. Too cold. Unsurprisingly for the snow leopards, it's, it's too hot. Even with the terrible British weather, you should help cool it down by adding some coolers to their habitat. But let's start by opening up the temperature heat map and having a look-see at the temperature in the leopard's habitat. Temperatures. Okay, so it's cold here. As you here. can see, we already have one cooler in there. Let's pop some more down and get as much of the habitat as chilly as we can. Okay. Luckily for us, this habitat already has power, but you'll need to make sure of that in the future. Just so you know, if any part of a habitat is powered, then the whole habitat will be powered. You can find heat maps for all sorts of helpful things, so do be sure to explore them and make good use of them. So let's bring it down. It'll take a little Maybe? while for the temperature to adjust once you've added coolers or heaters, but now we've got the coolers in, we can address the leopard's terrain welfare. You see, what the leopards really want in here is snow and rock, so let's make that happen. Okay. Let's go to terrain, snow, and then just, can we make that a lot bigger? Intensity, we just, all intensity. Now then, all of that should give you a pretty good understanding of how to make animals happy. So I'd like you to go and check on all the other animals in the zoo and fix up any issues with their habitats. No. That'll increase the average welfare of the animals across the whole zoo. Stay in the zoo. And I that wanna... average welfare fix. is a very important statistic. 
Now, to quickly see how all your animals are doing in the zoo, you should go into zoo management and then into the animals section. Not bad. Not bad at all. I think it's fair to say that you do passed do the it? first part of your training with flying colours. There's still Yay. lots to learn, but we'll have to head to another one of Bernie's zoos for that. If you want to grab your passport, we'll head off, shall we? Yeah, let's go. Where are we going? Save zoo. Don't save zoo. Mmm. Sounds like you've got the whole zoo purring away nicely. I'm done. Well, purring, grunting, screaming, booing. <laughs> All the uh, appropriate noises. I guess I was right to hire you, huh? Yes, you were. <laughs> Don't tell her I told you, but Nancy wasn't sure you'd even last the morning. <laughs> so we're happy this is working really? out. And Nancy she really had that little faith coffee. in me? <laughs> As strange as it seems, considering we just met, when I look at you, I feel like you're the child I never had. After the one I did have, obviously. Oh, dear Lord. But you see, I like you as better as a child. Don't get me wrong. Mm -hmm. Emma absolutely loves animals. But so the peacocks she are free roaming. Mm -hmm. Wants to save the entire right? planet. I'll no, they're not. The oh, that's species. interesting. Oh, and maybe having a type of frog named after me. <laughs> yeah, the peacocks. These are peacocks. Why are they free roaming? Hungry. Okay. Um, how do we leave? Um. Can we? Can we? Can we? Can we quit zoo? Uh, okay. Actually, free roaming zoos. I think, yeah, that makes sense. Oh, that makes a little bit more sense. But it's still like, eh, eh. okay. So let's go apprentice. You got an eight. Usually mix in with other birds. Fair enough. Okay, let's go medium difficulty. Because it is apparent that at least I'm not incompetent. <laughs> oh, there it. Mm. You know, I think my um. Oh, what is it called? My um, VTuber can technically be like I can connect it with my. Um, iPad? We're not trying that today. Maybe eventually. Welcome to Madagascar. It's quite the change of scenery Gasker. from dreary old England, huh? <laughs> Apart from the weather, I suppose. They don't call these places rainforests for nothing. <laughs> oh, yeah, Madagascar is that. working in is an ape sanctuary. Uh -huh. We're doing vitally important conservation work. Just not just for apes, me how to use a PNG. But for all kinds I don't know how to use a PNG apes, tuber. Well, apes I don't know how to do that. I know how to make a VTuber. But that's, yet, yeah. The way I don't do PNG like, tubers because well, I'm very much like some lazy. Of us treat our um, I haven't even tried to figure out how they work. Um, <laughs> anyway. That's why I'm determined so, that our operation here does some good. That's why you'll see this is a VTuber. Because we she's much easier to work with. And speaking <laughs> of states, I have a horrible feeling I left the house in the right one. <laughs> when I get back, I expect my life won't be worth living at all. <laughs> Worried. Bernie, are you okay? What do you think of Madagascar then? bit warm for my taste to yeah be anyway this is bernie's primate sanctuary it's not just primates though we've got all sorts of animals so why don't we go and have a look at some of them eh we'll no. start by taking a look at the red ruffed lemurs they're the ones that look like they should be in a shakespeare play <laughs> come on let's head over to them hi we're getting into it Locate the highlighted area. Wait, wait. Our two objectives are locate the highlighted area. Red rust lemurs are found in the rainforests of Masuala. That's in northeast Madagascar. 
They can actually live anywhere from 15 up to 25 years. Fancy that, eh? Okay, when you're ready, let's go find our Borny and orangutans. Okay. They're here. The Borny and orangutan is such a marvellous creature. They're all the big favourite at any zoo they feature in. And they're also the biggest tree-dwelling animal on the planet. He's so big. <laughs> Assuming you don't count any lions that got stuck up one. Oh, why don't you take a better look at them? Maybe. Open up their information panel and go into the animal camera. <laughs> I don't like that our first shot is there. Are they just incredible. I want to give them a ready, hug. Let's go and have a look see at some of our beautiful bonobos. <laughs> They're quite the characters. You just got out. Cool. Um, if you want, you can link it to me and I can um, put it in my Discord. Um, keep the highlighted area. Where are we going? Okay, we're going over here now. Oh dear. It looks like we've arrived just in time. One of the habitat's barriers has collapsed. And wouldn't you know it, one of the bonobos has made a run for it. We'll need to catch them. I love that. Before we do, we should box up the other bonobos to stop them escaping too. Select the habitat boundary to bring up the habitat information panel. Yeah. Good. Now open the animals tab. Can we just do like this? No? Okay. Stop. Stop. Can, can we just like fix this? Wait. Can we... Fixed it. It's like, no, you can't fix that yet. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what to do with the title. Fair enough! Okay, so... We're failing at this. Where are we? What are we doing? Put that back. Okay. Animal. And click on box all animals to box up the remaining bonobos. Where is that? I just sort of guessed the titles, I'm gonna be honest. Where? Box all animals. Now, we'll need a vet to recapture that escaped bonobo, but it seems our last one left to do some research in the wild. Not an ideal situation. So, we'll need to hire a replacement, sharpish. Go into the zoo section okay. and then into the staff management area. Who? You can find all of your staff in here, but there's no time to go looking at their particulars at the moment. Hire a vet. Hire a vet. Now click on one of the paths to place the vet in your zoo. Oh. Oh, okay, that's a relief. <laughs> So while the vet deals with our bonobo friend, let's go fix up their habitat so they can't escape again. <laughs> Head back over there. Hey, we're over here. As you can see, the barrier's collapsed. Someone's taken their eye off the ball, obviously. Let's get this one replaced. Select the barrier and then we'll edit it. Delete the broken section of barrier and replace it with a brand spanking new one. Wait, what are we doing? <laughs> I know what we're doing, but she explained. Okay, place the barrier wall. Press delete. Okay. Broken barrier selected, and then press delete, and then we can do that. Good. Woo! Now that we've done that, we need to make sure to add climb-proof barriers to the top. That way, the bonobos won't be able to climb out. Just make sure you've got the correct piece of barrier selected when you do that. Climb okay, proof. So go into the options section and select Both. which side the climb proof barrier needs to go on. And don't Both. get it wrong. <laughs> We're more worried about bonobos climbing out than guests climbing in. No, no, no. We should be worried about guests climbing in. Nicely done. And I I'm very worried about we that. Box those bonobos, wouldn't you say? <laughs> the poor mites will get sad if we leave them in there for too long. No. Select the habitat barrier to bring up the habitat information panel again. Okay. And then go to here, and I then assume, the and then tab. unbox all animals. And finally, click on unbox all animals to let them out. I expect some of them are fed bursting for the toilet. It's been like five so, minutes. It turns out that as well as the old vet, two things, mechanics? The mechanics did too. We'll need to hire a couple of new ones so we can help stop any more breakouts. 
You see, mechanics do all sorts of helpful things around the zoo, but one of their most important jobs is taking care of the habitat barriers. <laughs> Without mechanics Just... around to repair them, the barriers will crack, crumble, and fall down. And it's their it, fault for not stopping me section, from adding in so many. Again. Isn't there... We have been busy, haven't we? Good work there. 90% of them has is just the mechanics. Wait, what are we doing? Oh, oh you, yeah. you had a bit of an issue with an escape bonobo. The main thing is that you dealt with it swiftly. And more importantly, without the animal stealing someone's clothes, putting them on, and then walking out of the front gate. Has that happened it's before? Key responsibility for our Sir? Research. Has research that happened before? To unlock new enrichment items, additional information for our education resources. I feel like he had a monkey steal his identity. To food quality. I'm just saying. <laughs> the animal's food, not the Because I wouldn't be surprised if that was true. To improve the staff canteen. <laughs> anyway, as you can see, research is a key part of running your zoo. In order for a vet to undertake research, they require a research center. Right. And once again, that's something that this zoo is missing. So let's build one. I've marked out an area for you to put it. Uh, what are we doing now? I should pay attention a lot more than I actually do. Okay, okay. We're here. We're now, here. You've probably noticed that there's already a building where I want you to build the research center. Yes. Don't worry. You see, the building that's currently there is actually a hollow shell. So we're able to place our new building inside of it. If you select the research center for placement and then hover over the shell, you'll see that it asks if you want to add the research center to the existing building. Oh. Okay. Click to add it to the building. Oh, but that won't place it in just yet, though. First, we'll need to rotate our research center so it okay. automatically connects to the path when we place it. Oh, I need to flip it. That, mm, that way. That way. That way? Did I do it? Make sure to connect the path. I'm pretty sure it's connected. Efficiency is very inefficient. Good to know. Good to know. Ah, uh, construction, maybe? Uh, path. Path. Um. What path is that? What the heck? So you kind of let some random person kind of take over your place and you're not giving a very good ways to do anything here. I'm just going to be honest. Okay. So can we do like connects? It connects. I thought it connected. I'm not sure anymore. Ah. Okay. Oh wow. That that's interesting that they it's like separate pits. Okay, okay, okay. So I've messed up. But I don't know where. I'm getting a public service call. Fun. Okay. Can we make a staircase? <gasps> We're gonna keep the random staircase because I think that's gonna be funny. What? Where are we now? Okay. Wait. Facilities. Research center. See. Flip it around. There we go. Blended we work. did it. Now that we have a brand spanking new research center, we can give our vet something to do in there. And a random staircase oh, that goes nowhere. Way, it's worth noting that the vets will only do research when they're not required to do any other jobs. That said, you can change what jobs a vet does via their information panel. But let's not worry about that just now. So, let's get our vet researching ringtail lemurs. Go into the zoo section and select lemurs. vet research. He 
here, you can see a list of all the animals present in your zoo. Okay. And also all the potential diseases that can occur. Great. Now, drag and drop your vet onto the ring-tailed lemur to start their research. Actually, thinking about it, I'm not sure we've got any education boards or speakers by the lemur's habitat. Let's head over there and add them, so our guests can learn all about the furry little delights. The furry little delights. Okay, where? Okay, we're over here now. And then... We... We've located the highlighted area. We found Hillary. First off, let's pop down two education boards. Place them on the habitat barriers at a height that guests can see, or if you like, pop them down on a stand. Okay, so if we go here, there, there. I don't think that's how that works, but okay. <laughs> just... Just place... <laughs> this is the point. I don't know what that is. Educational boards. That's what we should have clicked. Are we doing this right? <laughs> oh, we shouldn't have it that way. We shouldn't. <laughs> I don't know what to... I don't know if I'm doing this. Oh. Seating. Viewer point? Speakers. Video. My, mm, I don't know if I'm grabbing these right. I'm gonna be honest. And from the drop down list, select ring tailed lemur. Although I'm sure that last part was obvious. When you link an education board or a speaker to an animal, you need to make sure that said animal is close by. If it isn't, the guests will get confused and won't learn as much. No, no, no. No, I think that's better. Okay, so... Do we still need to put more? We need to put more. Okay. You go facilities. All right, the memorial plaque that we have down here. We need... We need to... Uh... Place image. Can we? Can we? Can we? Do we need to scroll down to ring-tailed lemur? Reindeer! <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> exactly what they need to know. <laughs> oh, that's better. Um... Ring-tailed speakers. Okay. A lovely memory of John Doe. <laughs> sure. Sure. That's... <laughs> That's a thing now. <laughs> this is fine. Okay, so... There's a speaker there. A speaker there. And then if we do ring tailed, and then do another ring tailed. I think we did it! Miss, I think we did it. We didn't do it. We didn't do it. Because I guess the trash can monitor does not count. I'm sorry. Can we relocate this? Or do we just need to, like, yeah. Dang it. Wait, no, we're going to keep it. It's his fault for- oh, dude. Can we- 
Uh, mm, uh, mm, why can't I place these horizontal? <laughs> like, what the? What the? But, but, da, da. We're fine. We're fine. Surface move. Okay. That did nothing. Guess we're putting that there? <laughs> Move. Rotate. Can we rotate it this way? There we go! Wanna learn about some lemurs, kids? Um. Okay. That looks better. That looks better. So now we need to scroll down and find green telemas. Okay. I was wrong. That's not what we needed. What? What? We're just putting that there. Okay. Now that they've been put into position, we have to tell them what animal to display information about. Select Already one done. of the education boards to bring up its information panel. Already done. Already Fantastic. done. Fantastic. Oh, it's worth remembering that education boards and speakers both need power to work. They won't do much good without it. Joking. Oh, it looks as though our vet has completed their research on ring-tailed lemurs. We'll need to collect the results. We can do that by clicking on the notification or by oh. going back into the vet research area. Ta-da! Research complete. On, collect your research rewards. Just so you know, vets will continue to research an animal even after successfully completing a research level. Oh, so God. I suppose when you're in the zone, you're in the zone. How many vets? Oh. Well, now that we've enriched the lives of our guests, let's enrich the lives of our ring-tailed lemurs. Some animals, like lemurs, will have a climbing need. That means they have a requirement for a certain amount of climbing space. And you can fulfill that requirement by building They're them a climbing gonna know frame. Everything. Let's find out how We're going to know about monkeypox. Shall we? Select one of them and bring up their information panel. From where? So I guess these are like... Sure. I guess that's fine. We can't move it. So it's gonna complain about that until we can, and I can't move it, so... Whoops. Um... Okay. Satisfy. The lemurs. Okay... Where is a lemur? There we go! Next, click on the terrain tab. Ah, now, as you can see, the lemurs need quite a lot more climbing space. Hey, but hello! Happens, I've already got a climbing frame blueprint built for you. So oh gosh. you can either pop that down or build one yourself from scratch. By the way, it's not always just climbing needs that you have to worry about. Okay. Other animals might need a certain so, amount of water um, habitat, so they can go for a I'm sort of destroying <laughs> this game, I want to say. Um, not on, not on purpose, not on purpose. Um, it's called, so, I used to play, um, oh, what is it called? I used to play Zoo Tycoon when I was younger, so, like, I sort of, I'm used to, like, these type of games, but, like, this game was just so confusing and I had no idea what the heck to do. So, um, yeah, we had the pack for Zoo Tycoon where you could, um, oh, have, like, the Loch Ness Monster and, like, dinosaurs and stuff. So one of my favorite things would be, like, making a zoo and then, um, and then having it where, um, oh... You know, just hanging out. So there's a huge learning curve. Yeah. 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 
yeah, so that's why we're doing the tutorial at the moment. The tutorial. Um, and it's purely because, like, I've tried to play oh, this game multiple times. Timing frame for them. They're going to absolutely love it. Do you know what would make them even happier, though? Sand. Nicer food. But that's true of all of us, though, isn't it? No, they need you less sand. Better quality food for animals. Need more of them. Long grass. Luckily, we've already unlocked some for the lemurs, so all that remains is to make sure they get served it from now on. Let's bring up the habitat information panel by selecting the lemur habitat. And then if we could do some short grass instead of some long grass. And then we add in some rocks. Is that just generic rock? Hey! I think we've done it! I think they like it. Also, hi. Hi! Um, hi Ash. I am Alyssa. You can even call me Alyssa. You, I, I know the whole thing's thoughts that are weird, but like, let's be honest. It's, thoughts that are weird is a little bit too much of a mouthful. Imagine, like, it's like the whole thing of like, oh, thoughts that are weird is my mom's name. Like, is, is the family name. Just call me Alyssa, you know. But it, it's not, it's more of a like, it's just long to say and like, Alyssa sounds better. Okay. How the heck do we upgrade it? Are you free to stay and hang out for a bit? Um, okay. Call a mechanic. I don't know why we're calling a mechanic, but we're calling a mechanic now. Now select the animals tab. Uh, animals. There we go. As you can see, we can set two. the food quality in here. Dear Lord, Just okay. Just click on the drop down menu and select grade keep the two highlighted food area. Grade two food right. quality. My mouth already Still watering. Up. Okay. So, a new climbing frame and better food. Yes. Oh, you really and the mechanic was called on it. Now, I think it's time we looked at one of the zoo's most important responsibilities. Okay. Releasing animals into the wild. You well, this is a sanctuary. An is ready, we can I think there's a difference between a sanctuary wild, and that, so... What makes an animal a good candidate for release? Well, their age is an important factor. I mean, we can't release an animal that's a juvenile, just as we can't release one that's gotten too old. Fair enough. They'll also need to be fertile. After all, the idea is to repopulate the wild, so the best candidates will have a high fertility gene. And Fair together, enough. the age and fertility Fair of enough. a candidate will determine how many conservation credits we'll be rewarded when we release <laughs> them. Now, conservation credits are vitally important. They're the lifeblood of your zoo. Okay. Them are you, you done talking? More animals. And what's more, the animals you can adopt will be of a higher quality. <sighs> so, with that in mind, let's pop over to our orangutan habitat. Where is that? Okay. I'd like you to find Ageng, the Bornean orangutan. No, no, no. And select I don't know where we are. You can either click through each orangutan in turn. Where are or we? select the habitat barrier, go to the animals, animals tab in the habitat information panel, and find him in the animals list. I have lost. I have lost. Rang? Is that it? Orangu? Release! We found him! Can't undo this action. Please. I know it's sad to see him go. Boy, happy out in the wild. We're never going to do that. <laughs> Young, strong, and fertile. Excellent work there. You definitely got potential, you know. A British woman saying young, strong, oh, and fertile. I see you've been doing some homework. Yuck. Oh, no, it hardly seems like work when you're learning about something as adorable as a ring-tailed lemur. Fair. I imagine I'd have got much better grades at school if there had been less algebra think. and more Fair? algebra. Fair? Um, I think it's more fun to create chaos. Now let's Strong the and fertile. Just add it to the Cosmic and cow ice cream? Then pop it into Bro! The Bro! Wait, what are we doing? Gila monster? Why are we making a gila monster thing? What are we doing here? Okay. Build a new exhibit. Adopt a Gilamont. Why is this highlighted? 
I'm legit. Like, it's... Mm. What is a kill monster? What is a kill monster? What the heck is a kill monster? What the... What? The, what? Toilets? Why is that highlighted? <laughs> I'm scared. I don't know what's going on. Okay. So, so is it like delete? Delete here? Just delete. Why is this here? Uh, here. I'm dumb. There's there's a reason this has taken forever for me to start. Is this what we need? Editing group. Can we just perfect. The perfect. next thing to do is adopt an exhibit animal to go in there. How about a healer monster? Open up the healer monster and adopt one. Adopt. Send a zoo. Just send him in there. Habitat animals. We need to send the healer monster to the exhibit. Here. Click on the exhibit to send it there. Yes, he is being when sent. When you send an animal to an exhibit, it'll automatically be given the correct setup, but that Perfect. doesn't mean it's completely ready for them. So let's finish it off. We'll start by adding some enrichment items. Click on the exhibit to bring up its information panel. I think you can hear the thing. Let's turn that down a bit. What are we doing now? Oh, I need to be paying attention a lot better than I actually am. Okay. Add enrichment. Where is enrichment? Okay. I think it's habitat. And then enrichment. And then we go to toys. And then we give him a pumpkin. Can, can we give pumpkin to... The man. Good. Now click on the layout tab. Layout. Oh, well, it looks like we've only got the enrichment level one items unlocked at the moment. Never mind. Let's turn on at least one of them for the healer monster. Okay. We we turned all As of I'm them. I'm sure you know by now. You can unlock more enrichment levels by having one of your vests. Humidity needs search. to be higher. Now we'll also need no, to set lower. the temperature and humidity in the exhibit. These are vitally important for keeping our healer monster happy and comfortable. I'm sorry if you hear my roommate. Click on the climate. Tab. I don't know what they're doing. Here you can see the healer monster's desired temperature and humidity. You can change both of these by adjusting the dials below. Make sure it's going to be nice and cozy. That's the ticket. <gasps> and the last thing we need to look at is setting up the different windows. So click on the windows tab. Oh, you meant... Oh. <laughs> Pop them down near your exhibit to teach your guests about them. Let's add one now. Wait, what are we doing? I zoned out. Place one exhibit ex education board for a gila monster. A gila monster! There we go. <laughs> what? Is that even facing the right way up? Can you guys stop for one second? Dear Lord. Wait, it's a TV mount. Wait. Concept. <laughs> and then go here. Wait, I don't think it likes this. So let's try... Ah... Uh, there we go. Education... Education board? Mm. 
a gila monster. Now our guests can learn Perfect. all about our venomous friend here. Right, now, I've got a bit of a big job for you. I need you to increase mm. the number of species in the zoo. You'll probably want to adopt both habitat and exhibit animals to do so, which will mean building plenty of new habitat and exhibits for them. Okay. Come on, off you pop. I'll check in with you when you're almost done. What are we doing? I need to pay attention a lot more. I know I keep saying that, but like, man. Have at least 12 species in the zoo? How can we check that? Animals. Ah, species. How many? Uh, so we got one. He exists? Why does he have a different picture? Oh, he's cause, is it because he's male? Okay. Um... And they have different pictures because they're children. Um, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. I'm not getting that right. I think I'm getting that right. I might be wrong. Um, so like, can we just straight up, okay, so what animals can we get? Oh, we can get like any animal. No, we can't get like any animal. hop a ball a hop a ball One. Okay, so, uh, <laughs> Are we putting this? Do we just make one? Is that what the thing is? Wait, can we have a replay of the dialogue? Lovely stuff. Now our guests can learn all about right. our venomous friend here. Right, now, I've got a bit of a big job for you. I need you to increase the number of species in the zoo. You'll probably want to adopt both habitat and exhibit animals to do so, which will mean building plenty of new habitat and exhibits for them. Okay. Come on, off you pop. I'll check in with you when you're almost done. Okay. Now I understand what's going on. I'm pretty sure, I think, maybe. We're going to say I know what I do I'm doing. Okay. Guest facilities... Animal exhibitions. That's a giant greenhouse. Ah, you have to have a DLC to buy all this. You also don't have enough money, don't you? Cause you're you're not rich. You're boring. I'm rich and boring. Why can't we put anything? I just, I just, I just. Here now. Here. That's that's where Animal be now. Animal be there. Can we put Animal there? What Animal put there? Let's... Can we put a hippo there? <laughs> we should be able to put a hippo in there. And no. Okay. Are we not going to be able to put anything in there? And is it- we can't- okay. Thanks, I guess. So I think right there is the best place to put this stuff. So I guess we'll just kind of- Sure. I don't know if I'm doing this right, I'm gonna be honest, but it can make it look like a heart or the strong shape. Good enough. Ah. Oh. <laughs> and then let's do like what they've done up there. And do kind of like a And then... I 
then boom and then boom to boom Ta da we've done it it i don't know what this looks like i feel like it looks like a heart i feel so let's exfab that Edit barrier. Um, that's not what we want. Can we just, can we do that and then hit that? Oh, it isn't letting us. That's what I meant to do. It was a heart, scientific diagram of a heart. Yeah, I was thinking, can't we, can we make these higher? I uh, rise. Okay. Change them all to. Cause I I don't I feel like there's a point where they're gonna go and they're just gonna give up. Um, I want them to see into other to other things. I don't know. I think that'll be interesting. Okay. So then I think here we need to make sure that no one can climb in or out. Um, just in case. Don't want those pesky guests coming in if you get what my drift. Um, okay. So let's... Oh, we can't do that yet because we need barriers. Barrier, okay. Let's put one there. One there. I don't. I feel like that's not how they're supposed to be placed. Um. Do one there. One there. And then we need one over there. And then just so that they can get in between stuff now. Um. So we've done that. Let's get paths going. I think over here, why is there so many different paths? Okay. Is that what we want? Perfect. Got to meander. Straight lines are for chumps. <laughs> Uh, can we get that to be a different thing? Perfect. That there, that there, and then we gotta make sure this meanders as well. Because this isn't our money, so like we don't have to worry about saving money if it's somebody else's money, if you get my drift. Perfect. Yep. Everyone will <laughs> love this um facilities and then there's also a thing that they have introduced to me um a donation we gotta get that dough that donation perfect make sure it's right in the middle of everything Make sure they know that we need support. And we need a lot of it. Okay. Um, this is looking great, isn't it? Yeah, we're doing great. Um, ML trading. Adopt. 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 I'm just going to adopt every single one of these. Why? Um, you shouldn't be asking questions like that. Oh, do we not? Move. Too expensive? Wait. Oh, what? Wait. We can't buy any of these? Okay. So 
Western Trading Center. So if we go Santa Zoo, let's give the hippos the big place. Um, Santa Zoo. And then Bobo the Clown. Ah! I don't know what that was. We're fine. We're fine. Maybe. Santa Zoo. And then send to zoo. Uh, send to zoo. Send to zoo. Can they not get in there? Okay, so it marks this as being a single habitat. Good. Um, are they even coming? Where are they? Where are they? There they go. They're running. They'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. They'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. Oh, gosh, she tripped. <laughs> okay. And then you got she. What is needed to take care of a hippopo? Hippopo! Okay. So let's do some terraining. So they need s less soil. More rock. Okay. That sound better? Cool. Um, let's pause this. Um... I don't know what that means. Navigate swim area. So we need swimming. Which means terraining. Which means we're flooding the exhibit. <laughs> no, 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 no. We're not going to... Maybe? No, we shouldn't. We could, though. Enrichment. Okay. So we need... Aquatic pack root. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> what kind of enrichment do they like? Oh, they need food. Underwater fish, tree forager, plant. New plant. Toolbox. Termite. Spend it. What what do they want to eat? Like, what kind of animals are they? What do they normally eat? We need social. Social welfare. They need more. Okay. Space. Cutting issues are present. Really? Really? You're going to do this to me? Enrichment. What type of enrichment do they like? Do, 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 do they just not care? Too few adults and juveniles and animal social group. We're working on it, buddy. Genetics. Okay. Um. <laughs> large barrel feeder? They like that. Okay. Good. Um. Toys? Can we give them a cardboard box? Do they, do they like box? They like gyro. They like the gyro. I guess. Um, interspecies? Can we... Enrichment is still low. Wait. Are they low because I've paused it? Okay. We're just gonna ignore the fact that there's not enough space in here for right now. Ah! <laughs> Cause I don't want to fix that. We're walking on the welfare over here now. Okay. Terrain. Terrain is fine. Cool. Coverage. Requires more plants. <gasps> we can plant. 
we can plant gardening have a dwarf that's not gonna do well is it okay yeah this this doesn't fit a new animal cool I don't care um they need more plants can I just like base put grass down can I just not put a crap ton of grass grass down here have a rock uh... Oh, it's plants that they like. Do we care if they like the plants? No, they don't like any of these. <clears throat> Why did they make them options then? Is there like a bulldoze? Can we can we make the size smaller? I don't like the noise that that's making. Um, nature. Okay. So at this rate, um, somebody's gonna call something really bad on this. Um, so continents Africa. So we've got to do African things. Um, she's really pulling out my accent today. That is tree. We have achieved trees. Okay, we're done. Tree, tree achieved. I think those are too big. We... Animal welfare's attracted protesters. I'm working on it. It's not like I'm not trying. Okay, we're gonna pause. <laughs> um, do you like the bobbin? You like the bobbin? Okay. Um, colorful ball. Ice ball. No. Large tire. No. Box. You like the box, okay. You like the boxes. Herbs. Like the herbs. Maybe. I don't think I really did much. Ah, plant screen. You have a dance dress behind there. Mud bath. You like mud? You want to get bathed in mud? That doesn't... Yeah, it doesn't go anywhere, does it? Wait, wait, can it go on top? It can go on top of the trees! <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> I don't see any issues. Uh, can that... Sure. Sure. Oh my gosh, they love the thing. They love the thing. Okay. Now it's food. They like that. Okay. You've got to get them to them first. <laughs> um, so we need a hanging barrel. That's not it. We need more food. Logically, this is how habitats are set up, right? No. There we go. Okay, sure. Um, and then social, yeah, who cares? Um, okay. So now we've got to edit the roads. I'm going to fold them. Okay. We could technically do like this. 
We've got to keep all of these visible and in plain sight. Because how else are we going to get donations if nobody looks for them? Or like if they're off the path. Like if you saw a donation thing that was off the path, wouldn't you be also like, hmm, hmm. Just saying. Okay. So not to make your thing a bit bigger, shouldn't we? So we've got a couple animals in there. Um, had its battery off. Can we? No? Okay. Can we do... Edit barrier and delete. Delete. And then... There we go. Perfect. That, that's how habitat habitats, right? Okay. Ah! We're fine. Now we select all of this. We edit the barrier. Select all of it. And say we want glass. Um, because who needs privacy now? Um, that must be uncomfortable. Okay. You, let's hit play, pause. Okay, so stress is fine. Hard shelter. We need shelter for these guys. Okay. Heaters. Do we need heat, heat this place? We do not. Okay. Uh, bed and shelter. Hard shelter. Um. Hard. Okay. Wooden. Can we do like? Do you? Hi there, Re. Hi, Re. Re. How's it going? I know you've already dipped. <sighs> but we are succeeding, maybe? I think not. We also put a little bit more sand around here if we want. Well, let's say destruction. Can we? <laughs> you. <laughs> Navigatable land area. What that means. We also have no water here, but I don't want to add water. Because they are not letting me add water. Because I think terrain, we can't sculpt this place. So they're just going to have a constant, like, up there is a little bit better. We can't add water, honey. I'm sorry. I can't really change that. Very for crowding issues are present. No, you're present. Nah. Wait, we can just right click. Ao. Okay, so if we do that. Click that, click that. Let's do one way glass. Selectively you can see in, but selectively you also can't see out. <laughs> so there there's the illusion, the illusion of having privacy. <laughs> it's like teenagers. The illusion of privacy. Okay, one way glass. And then 
select all one way. Yeah, perfect. You can see in, but sometimes they just can't see out. Um, <laughs> it has attracted protesters. I'm working on it. Dismiss alerts. Dismiss all alerts, because I'm aware of the issues. I'm aware of issues. I'm aware of issues. Just tell me I'm doing good. Pat my head and tell me I'm doing a good job. Even when I'm not. Because I don't I don't think this is a good job. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest here, Bill. <laughs> can we oh, we can make them taller. <gasps> we can make them taller. Can we just perfect we need to make these ungodly taller. What? What? Oh. Oh, we can make them so tall. Let's not. We're 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 focusing on the wrong things. Um one of those things is neglected animals. Which we don't have enough money to fix. Because I spent it. <laughs> So, send to zoo. Um, send to zoo. Let's just hit play. Let's let's see if we we keep failing at this. Send to zoo. Send to zoo. Let's hope they're not big. They, uh, we've attracted more protesters, which I'm I'm sorry, ma'am, I can't do much. Give us money. Which animals are they first to? His welfare's fine. He's he's got friends. Oh, we can't climb. Okay. My nose is itchy. What time is it? How long have we been playing this? Okay. I was worried we were at like the two hour mark and I'd not noticed. Which I wouldn't put it past myself. Cannot be reached. Right. <laughs> um, I don't know. It seems like it could be reached. You guys are just cowards. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so let's view to be more there. I just, I just want to abuse these animals. Like, why, why won't you let me? Okay, see you, Mooflum. Talk to you later. So, so you got the dirt. We got the dirt. Move. Ah, uh, logically placing <laughs> plants. M tree. Yep, because that's how it works. Um What else? Yeah, there's two more here. No, no. Move there. There. Move there. Move there. I don't know what what the heck I, I guess there's a gift there um move you guys liked the dirt I think maybe ah I'm deleting that because it's, it's a pain yeah I think you guys would prefer food over that like can we just there we go Sure. Inaccessible. It's accessible now. Shut. Okay. So what are you guys complaining about now? Uh, critical error crowding issues are pressing. Oh, you're pressing. 
Can I just make a terrible habitat? Can I just make a terrible habitat and call it a day? It's like, this is so big, so big. I don't, I don't care enough. <clears throat> okay. We have 12 species in the zoo, though. We have over, like, nine. Because there's two here. And they are pooping all over the place. What? Can we actually, like, watch it in real time? Wait. <gasps> you can! Gross. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> oh, and they can move those around. They also got a box. Play the keyboard. Um. Well, Warfield, why are you complaining? I can't fix your welfare. I can't fix your guys' welfare. I can barely deal with the ones I currently have. Okay. Terrain. They prefer rock. Perfect. We're working on their welfare. Give me a hot minute, okay? Um plants and habitat oh it's in the habitat technically oh okay weird south central africa so let's just yeah because water lilies go on the ground <laughs> um can i just have grass can I just, can I, can I just have grass? Is that not a thing I can have? Ivy pillar? What, the, what? Why is this so weird? You can give him rocks. Got a big rock. Got a bush. Or a bush. They do not like a bush. Wait, do they like the bush? They do not like the bush. Ah, do you like the bush? You do not like the bush. Okay. Um, do you like the moss? You do not like the moss. Okay. Um, let's try this. Do you like that? Yes, you do. Okay. Let's throw those around a bit. There we go. They're happy now. Enrichment. They're like, we don't have a place to eat food or anything around here. Do they need shelter? They might need shelter. Shh. Um, can you give them a barrel? They like barrel. Okay. Toys. Grab ball? You do not like grab ball. Okay. Small ball. You like small ball. Skittle? You do not like Skittle. Sprinkler? What? Uh, no. Tire. You like tire. Good. Um, metal wire frame. Rubbing pillar? You like pillar. Okay. Um, too many in the group. Okay, so they need like half as many. Can we sell? Can we just sell them? Can can we send storage? Send a storage. Send a storage. Release. We shouldn't release these animals by going like, yeah, so, um, see ya. <laughs> and then, 
Okay, so they're happy now. Severe social welfare issues. Why do you have social welfare issues? Oh, you need space. Right. Do we care about that, though? Look, your place is cute. It's tiny. It's it's homey. Homey. Um. Cause there's their place. Their place is fine. Or crowding issues are present. That it's. But you're fine. You're fine. Um. I thought I gave you a hard shelter, but I guess not. Um. Facilities, nature, habitat. That's where we need to be. Shelters. Can I can I have like a rock shelter? Animal burrow. That's where you guys like to be. Um, metal. No. Okay. Where can I get like a proper shelter for these guys? Habitat? Is that what you guys like? No. Shelter. Oh. We need like a big shelter. Like a big shelter. That's a small shelter. We need a big shelter. Big shelter. Big shelter. Maybe. Do you guys do you guys like that? Okay, you're happier. Um let's try Big Shelter. There we go. I don't know how you're gonna get in. Oh, that's how you get in. Let's, can we move? See, there. Perfect. Is a disease risk. Yeah, okay, I see, I see your point. Um, but I don't know why they're not getting cleaned. Um, Every month, I guess. Why aren't they getting cleaned? Available food, available. I don't. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's get some water. Can we get like a water trough? I'm aware they're having issues. Do we need to actually put bedding in there? Oh my lord, this is a pain. When I when I said I wanted a fun game where I can just hang out and like be stupid. I was not Let me, let me live my life. Let me live my life. There we go. Shelter. You're now pissed at your shelter? What? <laughs> I'm not mad. I'm just very disappointed in this game. Oh gosh, we're adding more. Are we? I think we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Okay. Thank God. Um. Let's move that there. I love the fact that they can see each other into each other's um, enclosures. So it's like, oh. 
Do do you wanna do you wanna see into like this random person's place? Yeah, you do. <laughs> there we go. That's how we get rid of it. I love how they just sort of stop existing. Cause you know what? Same. So we want. There we go. I'm I'm getting annoyed at having to bend this all around the place. I say as I bend it again. <laughs> Can we You know what? That's that's how this is going to go now. <laughs> sure. Poor people who are having to deal. <laughs> They're gonna be like, wow, this place looks. What is over there? Uh, it's, it's, it's the enclosure. It's an enclosure. Uh, okay. What? They're not good at their job. And why did you hire them? I don't know. Okay. Let's pause this place. Right click. Uh, right. Delete. And then delete. Oh, we're fine. Um, then here. There we go. So let's have it bow out a bit. Perfect. We all, we love to see it. Oh gosh. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Let's move that to be here. Uh -huh. We're fine. Grab that. There we go. So, edit barrier. And then we want one way glass. But we want it all around the place. Why are you here? Okay. That should be one-way glass. We should have one-way glass all around this place. Why is not everyone taking the memo? And I feel like somebody doesn't know the definition of one-way glass. <laughs> this this isn't one-way glass, honey. Who, who taught you what one-way glass was? Well, okay, this is one-way glass, because you can only look through it one way. Um, but it's also incredibly wrong. Um, not reach habitat possibly due to your work zone setup. No, no, you can reach everywhere here. Oh, it's because there's a donation bin in the way. The donation bin is the forsaken one. Am I okay? I don't know. I'm a bit worried. Um. <laughs> okay. So. Oh, we can get bugs. We can bug now. And slugs. Is that Gary? Was there a Gary? Can we get more? Like, uh oh, wait. <gasps> Uh, I'm dumb. Okay. Let's quick trade. Confirm. Uh, right. Quick trade. Confirm. And then quick trade. Confirm. Because I don't need all of these. Because I totally didn't make a mistake. Um, quick trade, confirm. Quick trade, confirm. Uh, 
Um, so why did you buy a bunch of zoo animals? <laughs> hey, we can adopt. We can send a new one. We can't get more, though. Because they're too expensive. But... Is it? It's it's a space issue. They need a lot more space. Why? Why do you need so much space? There we go. They're fine. They're good. Ah. Okay. So we've got to. Vets, stop complaining. You know what? You know what? No. How little can we pay you, actually? <laughs> we're like, we're gonna go down. He's like, no. No. We're like, fine. We'll go lower. Uh, okay, that works. Oh, that's actually interesting. So we can discount our employee. <laughs> ah, capitalism. We also need to fix the speaker. Let's move that here. Okay, so that should be fixed now. Somebody else is here. It's raining. I wish it was raining here. That'd be nice. Hippopopatis. Where? Where am I? Where am I? Okay. Okay. So. We can get exhibits. Which is going to be a lot nicer because we are dumb. Facilities. Animal exhibits. Without donation as a thing. Um, can we just put a block here and call it a done deal? Um, can we? Sure. Those look stable. Sure. Yeah, why not? Um Adopt. This animal's being adopted for cash. Cannot be released to the wild. Okay. I don't plan to release to the wild. Two, three. Um, isn't there another one that we can get? We can get frogs! We can get frogs. Okay, so if we go in animal trading, or is it exhibit trading? Okay. Send to zoo, send them here. Send to zoo, send them here. Send to zoo, send them here. Send to zoo. Send him here. Send to zoo. Send him here. My, my, you have been busy, haven't you? Splendid. But now that you've adopted you all enough. these lovely new species, we need to make sure they're nice and happy. So let's get the average welfare across the zoo nice and high, shall we? And by we, I mean you. Go on, get to it. I have been though. I have been, lady. I've been. Ha I. I've been having. I've been having to. Okay. Um.
he's happy now so that's good climb it Concept, concept. Perfect. No. Perfect. Um, you, here. Uh, welfare. Exhibit. Uh, what's going on? Do you just... Humidity. So we need to change the humidity. Bring that down. Bring that up a bit. Right there-ish? Uh, maybe. Too far, too far. How did you bring the humidity down? They're slugs. Okay. You bring it up a bit. No. There's not a habitat that is at disease risk. You're at a disease risk. Should we can't do much that? Why are you at a disease risk? Is it just keeper assigned? Yes. Like what the, what the, the This is a my issue. Has attracted. You you're fine. Stop complaining. You've got space. You can walk around. You're just not. You're just not. Fine, fine, fine. You know what? You know what? You know what? Pause. We're we're gonna break the system. Delete. Ah. Delete. 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 And then delete that way. Okay. Hear me out, 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 hear me out. What is going on? Did I do something? Okay, people are just talking. Ah, uh, ah, uh, at a barrier. Okay. No, stop. I thought I could outsmart this place and I was wrong! I was so wrong. I am in pain. Can we actually, like... You can't put it there! Great, cool, great, good to know. I don't want to do it there, though. The terrain of the thing is so funky. Okay. We will take out ah uh, here. And we will just have like a hallway that goes to the water. You can't complain about having too little life when, well, like, too little water. When you're given, like, a lake, you know? Also, too little space. Psh, can't complain anymore. I have given you more than enough space. You just need to stop complaining. <gasps> what did I do? Oh, gosh, I pa I didn't pause. Wait. Did I pause? A dangerous animal has escaped. Are are they are they good now? Where what animals escaped? Oh, they're fine. Hi. We're good now. I'm working on it. Shut up. Um 
Yeah, look, look, you got water now. Stop complaining. Um, yeah, they're fine. See, they can't complain now. They've got to wonderful life. Perfect. And now the zookeepers. The zookeepers. Also, do we need to finish off anything here? Welfare to 90? Dear Lord! Okay, okay. How are you guys doing? You guys are fine. You're fine! Oh, gosh. Where did they escape? How did you escape? Eh? Ah! Oh, he's fine? Okay! I don't know what's going on here, and I'm worried. Can we? A dangerous animal has escaped. Where are you escaping from, though? Where? Because, like, this isn't an issue. Emerged. Okay. Yeah. Who cares? Stop. Z. Why? Why has nobody cared about this place? What the heck? Okay. Overview. Call Zoopy. We're requesting all of them. Not attended to the habitat in a very long time. You know what? Request them all. Mandrill? Um. Yeah, request request them all. Because I know we've got workers. So, don't complain. Mention my eye so it makes the VTuber look funky. Okay. He's escaped. He's, he's very dangerous. So very dangerous. So very dangerous. There he goes. Can we? Okay, so is he going back in his place? Sir? Sorry, bring back my animal. He's hungry. Yeah, I wonder why. Okay, so where do we check welfare? Okay, we are losing money. <laughs> 99 degrees. Dear Lord, that's warm. He's thirsty. Oh, we didn't give him a water thing. That can be an issue. That can very well be an issue. Ah! Food and water. Water station. Have have a water bowl. Have two water bowls. Have three water Oh! What? Okay. Crowding issues are present. But like, do they have enough people? I, I, I do they need they need better space? Issue. I might have to give them more space. Yeah. We will finish this today before I decide to call it a day. Okay. Who called? What are we doing? What? Just, just let me, just let me, okay. Right click, 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 right click. I think.
think we need to do this sort of situation. Perfect. And then I can edit the barrier. I was going to say sneeze, but I can't sneeze right now for some weird reason. Come on. There we go. There we go. Can we, can we actually... There we go. Perfect. Why well, you've already always said that you've wanted to be part of a zoo. What is that? I don't know what that is. I hope it's not an exhibit. <laughs> You look at Discord really fast. Okay, sure. Okay, what what's going on? Simply, what's going on? <laughs> I can't babysit right now as I am currently streaming. What? Can, can you explain what happened and why you need to be babysat? And why you decided to ask me? Out of all of the people? Like, honey, honey. I hang out with Corval. You really think I am old enough mentally to take care of a person? I don't... Okay, that's weird. Um... Add it to Ray. Can we do like that? No. No. Perfect. Okay. And then... Can we just... One way glass, all of this? Because that's one how one way glass works, I guess. Is you can see out, but you can't see in! <laughs> this, 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 this this. <sighs> okay. So now, I think I'm mostly at complete <laughs> having these. <laughs> Can we? Okay. No, I'm just stupid at the moment. Okay, fair enough. Well, let me finish stream real quick. Because, yeah, I've got to finish stream. Um, sure, that works. Just make sure they donate. Um, dang it. Okay, so how do you guys feel now? How are you guys, how's, how's the vibes? Social welfare issues, they need hot shelter. Hot shelter. Okay. Big shelter? Bigger shelter. Even bigger shelter. Bigger shelter it is. Um And then oh, they need climbing. Oh right, yeah, these he's got a lot to climb. So can we just make like sticks? Can we just Sticks. Let's just... Okay, the staff members are pissed. Um... But whose problem is that? Because it's not mine. So do we think that these guys can climb up here? Hmm. 
Amen. <laughs> I just imagine, um, there's, there's probably somebody out there who's, like, do I need to convince anyone that I should not be a zoo architect? Because I think we all agree, this is not how you zoo. Oh, what's going on? <gasps> Another dangerous animal has escaped. Oh, no! Has become invalid. Wait, is there another hippotamus? There's two hippo things? Wait. Wait, how did they escape? They're just- oh, oh. Wait. No? Why is it become invalid? Is there like nobody? Wait. <gasps> oh. Oh. Now I understand what's going on. Yeah, that is an issue. Yeah. Um. Now I understand some things. Okay. Perfect. Fixed. Sure. Because that's how you fix these things. Okay. Play. It should not be invalid anymore. Should not be. Nourishment. You need a keeper. All of them. Is he just... Okay, can we call that? It's thirsty. Right! We didn't give him water, did we? No, we gave him- no, we didn't give him- did we? We might have. Have a trough. You know what? You know what? Since you've been good boys, two troughs. You know, even better. You guys have been amazing. Three troughs. <laughs> um... Can we... Sir? Sir. It's like, I'm coming. I'm coming. What is this? That is not a cardboard box. That is not a cardboard box. I don't know what to tell you. Is hungry. Then get food. Um... Like, okay, we should be fine now. Oh my lord. Like, oh, we need things? Shut up. We are losing money at a fast rate. This is great. Ah. <laughs> Can we, like... Okay, what- how do we check- so zoo, I'm thinking. Finances, animals... Oh, we did things. Uh, facilities, education, transportation, memorials, visuals, overview. 
Uh, happiness. Crime. Dang it. Can we, can we create crime? We should create crime. Who's here? Where is that? There's an exhibit here? And we've not put anything in there? Huh. I don't know what to do. They're fine. Okay, they don't like the big trees. I get it. Um... They're the same species, right? Fine, they don't like the trees. <sighs> Nature. They like African. The palm trees, I guess. I'm just gonna put that's how trees work, right? That's how trees work. Um Where are the protesters? Where are they? I'm actually curious. Can we actually see them? Okay, fine. We're going to add Research Center. We'll place it. Can we get like a big research center? Did I zoom out? <gasps> e is zoom out. Where's this? That's funky. Anyways. Ooh, waterfall. Fall water. I'm in a mood right now. And I'm in a chaotic mood, I'm pretty sure. So I'm sorry for everything that I'm that you guys are experiencing today. Can we see spin it? Perfect. Now they can stop complaining. Yay! We're still losing money at an increasing rate. How do we check heat maps? Marketing. We aren't doing any marketing, which is a bad thing. We're on year five. What do we start off with? It's hungry. That's not my issue! Somebody's being an idiot! It's fine. We're fine now. Now you are hungry. So we need a vet to give you food! Swimming area. You do not need swimming area. I have decreed it. You don't need to swim. You know, I have a concept. I have a concept. Uh, trade. You can't have bad habitat if you don't have animals! Because <laughs> I think we don't really need them. You so Yeah, those been a box for too long. Then then like unbox animal? Yeah, he's fine. I don't know what you're complaining about. 
Wait, I just realized there's an easier way to do this. Can we just like release them? We can release animals. Yeah, because we don't really need all of these, I'm gonna be honest. Home. On this day, we are gonna release somebody new into the wild. Take care of them for like two minutes and then we're like, yikes. Release. What does our thing look like now? 85%. Okay, okay, we're doing better. Oh my lord! Do better! It's too much work to do. There's like 50 of you! I'm not mad. You're mad. Okay. So who else do we need to talk to? We need somebody on snail research. Someone be on snail research. Snails are the most important snail to snail of all snail kind. Snail. <laughs> if where, what are we doing? What are we doing? Where am I? Where? An accessible research center. Shut, shut up. You're fine. You. Ah. Don't need more of you. We need better for you. As for fine for better than for you. I need more on snail research. No, Goliath Frog. We need Goliath Frog. We need Goliath Frog. Okay. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. Can't find an accessible research center with space. You know what? You know what? Better idea. Better idea. Better idea. Better idea. Better idea. Vet research. Go back. No. Just put them all on. Like two things. So then they can't be researching anything else. Cause we need we don't need to know about the things. need to know about people dying. We need to know how we can help our froggy friend. Okay. We're gaining money. So that's a success, I'd say. Come on. <sighs> Everything's fine. How's it going in chat? Oh, we finished a thing? Who do we finish it for? Snails! Snails! Snails are gonna have a better habitat now. No? 
Okay. Like maintenance, log, climate, layout, and in the mills. What do we get here? Is it is it a Goliath frog? Hey, we got ones for each of them. Make it better for them. Let's go. So they're they're great. They're loving life. They're doing wonderful. We're almost into year six. Perfect. What am I doing? There we go. There we go. Good morning, frog. Come on. Tear snail. Come on. At least they stopped complaining that they can't get places anymore. Tigger snail! Our snail should be better now. Perfect. Now the frog. Yay! Continue. Now, is she acknowledging the fact? 90%. Who's less than 90%? Where do I check where the welfare is? Welfare. Cool, thanks. I don't care. Just do your work. Management. Staff, guests, exhibit some rules, exhibit welfare. Freaking check that. Okay. Perfect. We have done it. Can we do that with like him? Him? Can the ringtail lemurs? <gasps> we know we want the Gia, the Gia dude. Can we? Zoopedia. So can we check like? Cool. Thanks. Uh, anyways, um, animals. Cool. Thanks. Alright. There we go. So if we go here, maybe? No, that has nothing. Can't do this. Ba, ba, ba. Now just to wait for the things to be done. More ins go quicker.
You should be in there. Lawrence, go quicker. This is getting boring. Like, I don't know how to check welfare. Transportation, education, Sue rule. Low welfare. Yeah, what's going on? He doesn't have enough enrichment. He doesn't have toys. Okay, let's let's check out some toys. Do you just need like to climb? Social welfare issues. What the? What? What? He was. <sighs> I skipped a cutscene. <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Okay, so we should theoretically be able to go here. Get those going. And then there's one more for that guy. Is there any way to check the welfare? Because I think it's just me having it where I can't check overall welfare. Staff happiness. Vets and zoo. Um, where is it? I knew I brought an, I should have brought an umbrella. That's not a me issue. Hey, looks busy. I'll try somewhere else. Is that really an issue? Yes. We need more crime! Yes, I do. We need a lot more crime. We need all the crime. All the time. Oh my gosh. So I wonder if, can we go animals and then check it here? What do you guys need? Can we... Can we locate? Can we locate? For the love of God, can we locate? Bonna Bows. It's not these guys, is it? No, these are lemurs. These are mandrills. Those are also lemurs. What's over here then? Orangutans. What are they?
So that is their habitat. Okay. Quality. We need better food quality for them because they seem pissed constantly. Which I would argue is not really my fault. Welfare enrichment. Why did to cover insufficient food? Enrichment is being provided to cover all animals. So I need to deal with food issues? Okay. Is that something you guys like? No? Okay. Is this something you guys like? No? Okay. Hanging barrel. No. Large barrel. No. That. No. Termites. Termites. Can we do a mixed roller? No. Suspended forager? No. Tool puzzle feeder? No. Tree forager? No. Ah, there was something you guys liked. No. Mud? It's not mud. No. Rosenbrock? No. Just, just. Guess we're littering this place. Do we need to actually put in food stuff? That might be a thing we need to do. No. Food trough? Large. No. Special toy. Ah, they need toys. Bobbin? Mud. Mud? Mud? Mud. Have mud. No? Okay. Cardboard boxes. Mobile? Job there. Thank you God. should be proud of yourself. Not only have you expanded the zoo Thank and you. kept the animals as happy as Larry, but you didn't bankrupt us in the process. Amazing. Okay, we're calling it there because I'm tired. I'm pissed at this game now. We've been going for three hours, which tends to be the Sunday usual. Um, why are you tilted up? Face. Face is broken. There we go. <laughs> Fixed it. Um, but yeah, so we're calling it there. We're calling it there because I'm tired. I haven't eaten. I technically ate lunch, but I should probably eat something actually more food food. Um, but yeah, so it's been lovely hanging with you all, my lovely, lovely, lovely flowers. And I will see you all later. Watch my animation. Bye.